Hello and welcome to Toto TCG. You are here with me, Matthew, and we are back here with another Pokemon video on the channel. So in today's video, we're going to be checking out another new GX from the set for Full Metal uh, Wall, which will be coming out in our Unbroken Bond set. And as we can see from the background, it is slightly silvery, which means we're probably having a little look at the met a metal type in particular. So without further ado, let's do it. Let's have a little look and see what it is. So we have got, oh yeah, we got Lucario and Melmetal Tag Team GX. They're together. They are together. So we've had a Metal type Melmetal card GX. And we've had a Lucario, which was a fighting type. But now they're together. And boy, does it look awesome. It does look really, really cool. So it is a metal Pokemon with a HP of 260, not 270 like it does say there. It's 260 and is a basic Pokemon, which means you can just plonk this down and have a HP of 260 straight up right there. So very, very cool. And the artwork does look really cool already. Very, very cool indeed. So let's have a little look at the other artworks. We have got the full art right there, which does look so cool. Love this so much. You've got that massive tanky male metal right behind the Lucario standing there, um, but it's just taking up so much of the card and there's barely any background to it. It's so cool. So, so nice. We've also got the alternative artwork there, which I absolutely love this one. I think this is going to be a very nice card to collect. Um, having this one, they're both doing the same action. So Lucario's kicking, but Melmetal is also copying what Lucario is doing. That is so good. I love that so much. Very, very nice alternative artwork there. And then, of course, we've got the Rainbow Rare as well, which does look very, very cool. So there we go. So let's have a look at those moves. That's what we want to know. What are they about? And I think one of them might be very, very good for some metal uh, Pokemon. Definitely very, very cool. So the first one is called Metal Fist for two colorless. And that is 50 damage, and then you search your deck for a Metal Energy card and attach it to this Pokemon, then shuffle your deck. So, turn one, it's like, okay, DCE, happy days. You do the 50, You get, maybe not turn one, turn two, let's say that. When you can actually attack. DCE, boom, do the 50. It's not a lot, but it is something. Then you can get another Metal Energy. Next turn, happy days. They're not exactly going to knock you out for 260, are they? Possibly. You never know. Uh, and then attach another one. There you go. You can do the second attack. Now, what's the second attack? Heavy impact. For two metal and two colorless. 150 damage. Straight up. That's just what it does. So it does 150 damage, which is pretty cool. Um, I don't know whether the actual Mel Metal GX card would be doing more for four energies than this. So it might be worth doing that. But I think it's the GX that is really going to make this thing pretty cool indeed so the GX is called Full Metal Wall I wonder why the set's called Full Metal Wall hmm uh, so for one colourless and obviously the plus what does it do until the end of this game your metal Pokemon take 30 less damage from your opponent's attacks after applying weakness and resistance if this Pokemon has at least one extra energy attached to it in addition to this attack's cost Discard all energy from your opponent's active Pokemon. This GX is going to be very, very interesting indeed. Even if you just have that one energy on this thing, it's done its duty. It literally has just done its duty. You could put Rainbow Energy on this to put the 10 damage and just Acerola this thing away. Um, because obviously it'd be there, and if you're not going to focus on this card, but you want that 30 less damage... Now, bearing in mind, we've got cards like Scizor GX, we've got cards like Melmetal GX that already take that reduction. So they have reduction, but you're doing 30 more. Maybe you put Metal Frying Pan or Metal Goggles on your Metal Pokemon. They're going to be not taking a lot of damage, which is going to be really, really annoying for your opponent because they're going to be like, well, I need Field Blowers or I need to do more damage or it's going to take them a long time. And if you've got ways of healing yourself and obviously getting the energies back on, happy days. You, you're looking really good. So I am looking forward to this card. I really am. Because I think when I've got this card, I could finally probably make a metal deck that I'm going to be happy with. 
I tried doing Sizzle, and I enjoyed doing that because I, I, I love the frustration of your opponent not being able to do the damage. And it was so fun just to be able to have that. But to, to have even less damage is great. Absolutely great, and I love this. I love it so much. Really, really cool in my opinion. So, let's have a look at the rest of the card. Of course, it is a tag team, so when it is knocked out, your opponent's going to take three prize cards. Weakness to Fire. Resistance to Psychic, and that would be minus 20. And then a retreat of three. So, yeah, not bad. But, like I said, if you had that Rainbow Energy, you plonk it down on this. It's got the 10 damage. You Ace Roller it away. It's done its job. And you don't even... You could just Ultra Ball this thing away then. Because you don't want to use it. If you do want to use it, fair enough. Crack on. But for that GX alone, i just do that. I would literally just do that. So, yeah. Very, very nice indeed. Like that a lot. Seriously, seriously cool. So, yeah. Let's finish it off then. With the Guess the GX. The answer from our previous video, which would have been Blastoise GX. So, if you haven't seen that, go check that out. We gave you that picture there. What was that in particular? Well, if you haven't guessed it, you might have. You should have. It was Pikachu and Zekrom GX. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. There it is. So, very well done if you did get that. Good job. And then let's move on to the next one, the Guess the GX for this video. We have got that picture there. That one right there. And that one right there. So, let me know what you think that GX is in particular in the comments below. If you're new to the channel, then definitely make sure to hit that subscribe button below so you can keep up to date with all the uh, the latest, uh, I was going to say figures, the latest cards to be revealed, um, especially with obviously Unbroken Bonds around the corner and we're almost, we're almost there, we're almost there with the cards. The next set actually is already being released with some of those cards so uh, it's going to be good to get on top of that again and uh, get back to where we uh, normally are. So yeah, interesting stuff indeed, and I'm 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 enjoying it. I think this is going to be an awesome set. I mean, I thought Team Up was going to be great. This one looks whew, very very big set, very big. But we will get to that obviously. So without further ado, I'm going to just leave it here, and I will see you guys in the next video on the channel.